Oh, yeah. It's time once again for one of Livewire's favorite game shows, Romance Novel Title or Courtney's Erotic Fantasy. Seriously, Sean? You shouldn't have left your diary just laying around. So, tonight we have... I'm sorry, introduce yourself to the, the people here. Uh, Martin Reed. We have Martin Reed. Uh, tell us about yourself, Martin Reed. Uh, Fascinating. Okay, we're going to get right to it, guys. Here's the deal. I'm going to read a title, and all he has to do is tell me whether the title is a real, actual romance novel or an erotic fantasy that Courtney made the mistake of writing down somewhere. <laughs> Sound good? Okay. It's all up to you. Audience, can he do it? <laughs> I think he can, too. And if he gets more than half the answers right, he'll win a fabulous prize. Trisha? Tell him what he's going to win. Yes, Sean. Martin will win an improved sense of self and this copy of The Husband Hunt by Lindsay Sands. Wow. And people say we're a nonprofit. All right, Martin, are you ready to play? Here we go. Number one, sex lies and leprechauns. F real. Oh, good thing you reconsidered. It is real and it is amazing. Number two, pick up at the robot club, the Fembot Chronicles. Also real. Chronicles are hot this time of year. <laughs> Love and the loathsome leopard. <laughs> um, real. It is real. Alliteration is romantic. <laughs> Number five, the broken promise of Captain Christopher Dawson. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, real It is fake But it is a particularly saucy tale I enjoyed reading it Number six The centrally attentive pharmacist Fake It is fake A that good actually... job gets you about 90% of the way with Courtney <laughs> No, I just, I didn't have health insurance for a really long time, so I had all these pharmacist fantasies. Number seven, a duke deceived. Real. Real, and chapter eight was out of this world. Number nine, the drummer who stayed. Um, fake. It is fake. It comes after nine drummers left. Next one, His Majesty, M.D. <laughs> Real. Absolutely. It's, someone knows their romance novels. Number 10, Dr. Daddy. <laughs> um, I hope that's fake. It is 100% real. Number 11, The Surprisingly Gentle Pirate. Fake. Correct. Instead of ripping her bodice, he just asked her to remove it. The Marine and the Debutante. Mm, yes, real. Wow. Someone's been reading. <laughs> and lastly, Prince Charming in Fleece. Yeah, real. That was one of Courtney's local dreams. <laughs> Trisha, how many did he get right? Eleven. Eleven. Right. What a powerhouse. Unbelievable. Give it up. That is all the time we have for tonight. Thank you, Martin, for playing Actual Romance Novel or Courtney's Erotic Fantasy. Join us next time when we play Actual Line from the Twilight Book or Result of Giving Hamsters Tiny Keyboards. Good night. It was Sean McGrath and Trisha Ferguson with David Ian on sound effects. You've been listening to a snippet of Livewire, the radio variety show that's like a chew toy for your brain. For more information about the show or to download our podcast, visit livewireradio.org.